I've learnt the hard way to have the um, answers about in case I get these wrong. What do you need? They've always give you an alphabet and the idea is, is you actually use that. So D to B, so it's the first letter of the first letter, so D to B is back one, two. So you go Q back two, one, two, O. Now you do the second letter to the second letter. G to K is forwards one, two, three, four. So you go N forwards one, two, three, four, R. Oh. Let's see if that's right. No, it is. Just as well, isn't it? It would have been a bit embarrassing if it wasn't. L to I is back, one, two, three. So you go V back three, one, two, three is S. Then we do H to F, which is back, one, two. So you go Y back two, one, two. W. G to C. It's back. One, two, three, four. So you go B back. Now you have to go around the end of the alphabet for this. One, two, three, four. X. And then S to U is forwards. One, two. So you go Y forwards. One, around the end of the alphabet. Two. Now let's have a look. B to H is forwards. One, two, three, four, five, six. So you go K forwards six. One, two, three, four, five, six, Q. Now P to N. Back one, two. So you go G back one, two, E. J to N is forwards. One, two, three, four. So you go N forwards four. One, two, three, four. R. Now you do V to R. Back one, two, three, four. So you go N back four. One, two, three, four. J. F to Z. F to Z. Which way are we going to go? Let's go back. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we go S back six. One, two, three, four, five, six, M. W to Y. One, two. So you go Y forwards. One, two, to A. That's how we're doing answer wise. M, A. Good now. R. Ah. Now watch this. This is a pairing, I think. A, B is to Z, Y. So A is the last one here. See, so it could be either. And this is where having the multiple choice comes in. Because A to Z is back one. So you go C back one is B. Then you go um, B to Y is back one, two, three, so you go D back three, one, two, three, A. Now that's a legitimate answer, but it might not and probably wouldn't be in the multiple choice. So this is another one. Can you see that A and Z are the end letters? Then we've got um, B and Y are the next letters. These are mirror images, can you see? Then we've got um, C, so C would equal X and therefore D equals W. You just kind of have to feel your way around those, but primarily know that they exist. Well done for sticking through with that. Bye.